Hello everyone, welcome back to Zeth Medium. I am Jay Silver and this vlog actually being recorded on the same day as the Poops Kilogram uh vlog that I that I made. Um this one this vlog right here, as you probably read the title, I am I, I was thinking a lot about it while I was making the previous series. As you as you may may or may not know, uh I have this ongoing series on the channel. It's one of the oldest series on the channel, and it's probably my only unique series on the channel in terms of it's literally only my own content and no one else's. Um, showing off my art is one of the oldest series I've got going, and it's still going to this day simply because I keep drawing. Eyeless uh, Arts talked to me about it recently, which I think is what got it uh, got me to start thinking about it at first uh, and then I was making the 10th generation because I I'm currently working on the 12th right now uh, and I just finished uploading I had recorded it a while ago but I just finished uploading uh, showing off my art gen 10 parts 1, 2, and 3 um, and I was thinking about it They've always been kind of shaky in terms of, you know, how they work with the audience. Most of the audience doesn't stick around that long. In fact, I'd argue 90% of the audience doesn't stick around throughout the whole video. Which, you know, is becoming a, an increasingly uh, more popular thing with, you know, YouTube shorts and uh, lower attention spans and everything. What I did want to touch upon was the fact that, you know, usually... The showing up my arts videos range from somewhere between 30 to 45 minutes in length. Um, what I wanted to talk about was that I'm making an improvement, an improvement. What I want to talk about is the fact that I'm making an improvement to the series. And I I know you're probably thinking, oh, it's about time, you know, you've been taking too long. I'm aware. I am very much aware of that fact. What I did want to talk about was that I, I had this idea. And it's gonna, it might take some revision. This, this isn't the final draft, or at least... I will always be open to consideration if it should be a different way. What I'm thinking I might do with all future showing off my art, and I'm not talking about the old art showcase, I'm specifically talking about the main series, not the spin-offs. Because there's a hundred characters in a generation, Instead of dividing it up uh, between how many ever I get through in three videos, sometimes two, sometimes four, um, I'm thinking I'll show a determined amount of characters in each video. And I'm thinking by decreasing the length of the video, it'll, you know, typically that means I have to rush through more. But if I show 10 per episode, that means each showing off my art then becomes 10 episodes exactly, uh, unless I accidentally made extra people because I lost count somewhere through, um, which does happen. Uh, but that also gives me more time with each individual drawing to talk about them should I want to. Uh, so some videos might be really short because I could be doing like a, another Brawl Stars generation and there's a bunch of true gold and true silver characters in there that I just skip over because they're literally the same. Um, other ones, you know, it might be a lot of um, detailed drawings that might have a lot of stories about color variations and pencil crayon use and all that. I think this economically works better for everyone. Uh, by showing only 10 drawings in an episode, for all showing off my art going forward, um, thus 
increasing the amount of videos in the playlist by a lot, but also making the videos more consumable for audiences, more easy to edit on my part. It gives me a lot more time to take care of each drawing and show them off and explain them. It gives uh, the audience a lot more time to just sit there uh, and you know think about which one's their favorite. If they want a shorter video, that gives them that, that pushes that out of the way. I think, um, I think this is the right move. I think it is. Uh, I do apologize that I didn't think of it sooner. I, I feel like I've had similar thoughts before. The only reason I didn't act through with them before is because I'm I'm a I'm a, bit, I'm a guy of you know tradition and principle, and I, you know, I didn't want to change things. Because the biggest thing on my channel, and I don't mean to sidetrack a little bit, but the biggest thing on my channel, and one of the biggest reasons I don't edit my content, is because I don't make it to be flashy. I'm not tailoring myself to people of shorter attention spans. If people want to enjoy my content, then, you know, if they want to, they can skip through it. That is an option. That is a mechanic on YouTube, literally built in for that reason. If people are going to enjoy my content, then they're going to enjoy it in the rawest, mo most real, most genuine, authentic form that it exists in. Um, and so I, you know, my audience is small and I could probably grow it if I put more edit, uh, time into editing. But I prefer the smaller audience in the sense that I know that those people right now, I'm currently at 227 uh, subscribers. Those people are genuine. And I'm not saying I won't get more along the line than those people aren't genuine. But it's to imply that my minimal amount of editing um, and people still sitting through that content means that they're willing to sit through it because they actually enjoy me and not just the flashy lights and the cool edits and the sound effects and the zoom in and zoom out kind of thing and the cuts, you know, um, but just me. Uh, and that, that's what I want. That's why, that's why I like, I appreciate that. Um, so I think for a while there, the reason I didn't switch it up sooner is because in my mind, first off, you know, it's how I started the series. I might as well honor that tradition. But at the same time, it was very much like, if they care about what I'm drawing and they're actually interested in what I'm putting out there, then they'll sit through it. Those who actually want to know will know by sitting through it. Um, but I think this just works better for everyone. And I'm thinking that um, I'm thinking it's a genuine move. I'm, I'm thinking it is the move I'm gonna make. I've thought about increasing it to maybe 15 drawings, but that doesn't work out to 100 exactly. Um, and 20 is kind of where I was getting before, but like it, it takes me kind of long. I have to rush through some of them. And if I'm not doing too many Brawl Stars characters, then it takes even longer. So I think 10 uh, will create a very fine dynamic. But I also want your guys' thoughts. So. Uh, for those of you interested and you have opinions, I don't know when I'll get to Gen 11. I might get to it uh, next week. Well, actually, you'll be seeing this trend next week. I'm recording this on the 11th, uh, Sunday, February 11th, 2024. Uh, next week is my reading week, so I will be home. I can probably do it then. Um, and, you know, maybe we'll see. So, I don't know when this is going out to you. I really don't. But I hope you enjoy it all the same. So yeah, if you have opinions on it, if you want to bring up a discussion, you know, uh, I'm open to suggestions. So yeah, the comment section is there. Otherwise, yeah, that's all I got to say about that. So thank you everyone so much for watching. Uh, this has been the Zenith Medium. I am Jay Silver, and this has been um, my vlog discussing the future of showing off my art. Uh, if you want to look around, you know me, I got, I got more gaming, more vlogs, whatever else comes, I will see you all very, very soon.